Harry Osborne was still recovering after almost overdosing from taking too much LSD the night his father died fighting Spider-Man. A confused and emotionally vulnerable Harry would then find a Spider-Man costume in Peter's bedroom which pushes him to become the Green Goblin himself and attack Peter, who he's convinced killed his father. Harry would then get amnesia, forgetting Peter was Spidey and his father was the Green Goblin, and live a mostly normal life, even marrying Liz Allen and having a son with her named Normie. Until the Hobgoblin attacked him and his family looking for the Green Goblin formula that gave his father superpowers. Harry amnesia went away and he drank the Green Goblin formula himself to protect his family. But it drove him mad, essentially giving him multiple personality disorder. He defeated Spider-Man and triggered a countdown timer for a bomb, planning to kill himself and Peter before snapping back to reality and realizing his son and Mary Jane were in the building. He rescues them and even goes back and rescues Peter before dying from the experimental Goblin formula. Of course, people don't stay dead in comics for long and Harry would eventually return, but his death weighed heavily on Peter's conscience.